Hey everybody, it's Crafty Glamper 77. I don't know if you saw my community feed. I'm having problems with my phone recording. I've been so frustrated. I tried to do one last week and it cut me off 50 minutes into it. So unfortunately there's a lot of stuff on here I have already opened. I don't know if I'm going to take the time with the prices because it might abruptly just shut off on me again. Um, if it does, I'm going to upload it just like that. But please know if you're new here, that's not how I end my videos. If you are a repeat watcher, thank you for jumping on here and spending some time with me. I appreciate it. Thank you for your patience. This technology stuff of trying to do this just had me very frustrated. And I didn't get back on here and try. Like I said, it was one day last week or Saturday or something. I can't remember. But 50 minutes in was very, very frustrating. I've got all kinds of stuff here to haul. I've just been shopping. I've been catching up on team hauls that I like to watch and stuff like that. So I'm not going to ramble. <clears throat> and yes, it's going to seem very rushed and sped up because I'm just waiting for it just to pop up. 50 minutes in. It's just crazy. I don't know. I deleted a bunch of stuff on here and I, I just don't know, you guys. Okay. Well, I did this. I finally caved in and got some jewelry from the... I did not want to say the word because I was afraid I would say it wrong. But I'm going to leave out the T and just say Moistenite. But if you watch Hey Everybody, then you know what I'm talking about on the jewelry. She talks a lot about it. She buys a lot of it. Um, if you don't watch Hey Everybody, I suggest you jump on there and watch her hauls. She's hilarious. She's very unique. She's so fun to watch. But... Like I said, I'm not getting to open up a lot of this with you. There's a few things at the end I didn't get to yet. But this is a very beautiful, beautiful necklace. It did come with the card, the GRA card. I just don't know if I want to try to find all this. This right here was a free gift. I don't even know, honest to goodness, how I got the free gift. But I love this necklace. And yeah, I'll take a free gift. But very pretty, very pretty comes in this little box here and you pull it out see I want to be so detailed on here like I normally do but I'm so scared it's just going to shut off on me again if it does I'm not redoing this haul I'm just going to put all my stuff away and just forget about it but it does come with this little thing a little marble box so normally I like to talk and stuff like that with you guys but I'm just worried about this video okay and I did get these I opened some of this stuff. I've already got a refund on these because these were so messed up and flat. I've been curling them in to fix them. But they're for my air fryer just to kind of maybe save from the mess. I'm not going to say what they are. I'll just tell you what I paid um, just to save a little bit more on time. There's 50 pieces and I paid $1.88. Um, I did get a price adjustment. Um... But I ended up getting a full refund in the end for this because I just didn't like how, how they came shipped. They need to put them in a box sleeve or something to protect them better. But there's those two. I did get this cute little thing. It's an iron-on. If you have not done any of Timu's iron-ons and you like to do that sort of thing, I highly suggest them. I think they're great. Um, this is a Timu sweatshirt I got. Yes, I still have the same necklace on. I do not know now if I got it from Timu or Sheen because I ordered from both. I have not taken it off three weeks to a month. I shower with it and everything. It hasn't turned green. But once I take a necklace off, I just can't put it on by myself. I don't know. I, this has become one of my favorite eye watch bracelets, um, watch bands, and I just love it. I don't know if I got it from Sheen or Timu. I can't remember. But if you watch my previous hauls, you'll find it in there. Um, just going to get this real fast so you guys can see. I was talking and being so relaxed and everything in my first one. And <clears throat> now I'm just in the back of my mind ready for this just to go horribly wrong. But it says, touch my coffee. I will slap you so hard. Even Google won't be able to find you. So what I'll probably do is maybe make this a short haul, cut it off. I don't know if I want to push my luck into a long haul. So because of how my phone's being, I may have to, that was a fly. Don't do that. Just stay away. 
I may have to make it into shorter hauls. I personally like to get the longer ones in and get everything done in one haul, but if I have to do that, I will. On the other one, I was showing items I bought in the past, what I was doing with them, how I was utilizing them, things that I didn't like, things that I loved. I had some of my stuff that I bought from Hallmark, um, not Hallmark, gosh, when I think of Hallmark, um, that I had bought from Hobby Lobby and I made for my bathroom and my kitchen with my iron on and the stuff that I had found at Hobby Lobby, but I just don't know if I'll save that for another haul. I guess I could try to put it on the end if this doesn't shut off on me. These little things right here is one of the things I brought in because I bought some more. I literally, they're like 34 cents and there's 28 grids, but they look like this. I literally have my earrings in them. I have necklaces in them. I have certain backs that I buy and I keep my backs in them. Um, I'll get out one. I bought three because they're so cheap. It's like a dollar two for three. But here they are. You can hang them. I actually just stack them and put them on my vanity or in a drawer. They're supposed to go in a drawer, but sometimes I'm too lazy and they're on my vanity. Some come out. These do not. But they work perfect and they're good space savers for jewelry, um, scrapbooking, beads, anything that you want, you can use these for. But I did get three. And I've already done this for my phone. I had a cracked case. And I bought some of these, $3.59 for glasses, and I got three, plus these little things to go cover your camera lens to protect it. I think it only came with, two, no, it came with three of those, because I've already done one on my phone. And it come with all the one, two, I think like six of them total, two, four, yep, and I've already used one. So five's left, there was six. And they, well, they're a nice package. They come in styrofoam. But like I said, mine was cracked. And then I got another bad crack. And I was so worried it was my phone. But it wasn't. When I took it off and got a new one on, it was just the cover, the protector. So I did get more of those because I needed one. It only came with two protectors, six cleaners, and three of the eye, the things to go around your camera and protect them. Um, that I paid $3.59. It is Thursday, the 7th. Today is my dad's birthday, my biological dad. Um, so I posted something on Facebook and let him know happy birthday. I'm going to text him or message him later. Um, unfortunately, we don't talk a whole lot. We're not really close, but that gets into a... It's one of those life things, you know, just things that have happened and... It just, it, it is what it is. Okay. And I got another one of these and it come with the card. It's a moissanite on that necklace. I don't know if I told you it's a 925 silver and I believe I got the two carat and it was, like I said, it's a free item. When you click on that necklace, it's the two carat is 1619. The one carat six no the two carats twenty two oh four it says it's regular ninety nine ninety nine but who knows on that okay and then back here I got some cute moissanite earrings I'm not sure I don't know if I got one or two sets yeah I'm so scared to say moist moissanite if if you'd watch hey everybody you probably saw the haul that I'm talking about if you didn't it just someone commented that sounded like she was saying something else that she wasn't saying. So it's like, oh my gosh, do I just want to call them the M ear, you know, the M ring or M necklace, whatever I got. But no, it's it's moissanite, so that way you'll know what I'm talking about. Earrings. Where? Oh, where are you? Hello. I don't have time for this because it is just going to shut off on me again. Like I said, if it does, that is just, it's going to look like a rude ending, but I'm letting you know now at the beginning if it does do that. I'm done with that haul. I will upload it just like it is and delete that once it's uploaded and try to do another one for the rest. This is a four claw, I think, because I think I got two. 925 sterling plated moissanite earrings, and I believe I got the one carat on these. 
I did. They're really cute. They come in this little double bag. I will take them out. Yes, I got the one carat for $15.59. It's kind of cute. They separate the earrings. They got this, and then it's a Ziploc bag again, and then there's your second earring. But here, I'll just show these. Really pretty and shiny. Love, 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 love. And you got a set of those. Yeah, um, I think you could easily get hooked on the Moist Night earrings. They're very pretty, very shiny. They look real. Um, I love them. And then this is makeup. Oh, I wish I had the prices. See this? Maybe if my camera is going to do this on my phone, um, I may need to write my prices and go back to how I was always doing my hauls because it is less time. And if it's timing out on me, then maybe that's what I need to do. I don't know. But I love this. I paid $6.98 and I did get a price adjustment where you can see my pegboard where my stuff's being held. But there they are, beautiful colors. Um, I was prepared that time. I had my makeup wipes, which I do not have now because I'm not prepared. Um, but there's the gold color. They've got a really good pigment to it. Absolutely. So that's nice. And it comes with the, you know, your little mirror there. So there's that. Um, I already did that one, right? Yes. I'm going to keep opening the same stuff if I don't get get it away, get it away. I got these silicone straws. They're okay. I'm not as happy with them as I thought I'd be. I mean, they're the quality. They're nice made. I love the soft pastel colors, but they're, they're smaller. I was hoping they'd be a little bit bigger, and that's probably on me for not reading the size, but you did get a four set silicone drinking straws. They're for the 40 ounce little Stanley um, dupes that were a lot of us have bought on here and I paid a dollar for but they are very pretty colors you can get them straight or bent I got them bent so there's that oh I don't like being rushed I'm so sorry guys now watch it it might there's a chance it might not even do this and then I've rushed through this whole thing panicked and paranoid the whole time about it shutting off but it's one of those things I just don't know what it's going to do. Um, this is something to put my iron on. I don't need it for inside the house, but I do need it for the camper because your bathroom sinks aren't very big because the bathrooms aren't huge, you know. Some campers are, ours aren't. But they don't give you a lot of sink space at all. There's like hardly no edge, just a little bit. So I thought I could set this down on my toilet because my outlets over here set it down on the toilet and then put my flat iron there and let it cool here in the house I don't need it um as a silicone heat insulation pad it was a dollar 78 I did get a price adjustment there was other colors you can hang it up it's got this little thing here me I'll probably just put it in my in the cabinet or something like that just to get it out of the way but there's that. I don't know when anybody's coming home right now. It is just me and Harley. Um, this is a box. Oh, I got a refund on this because this I don't recommend, but I'm going to show it. Word. Because I bought it. And I don't like it. For one, these don't go up back in there like they should. It's very cheap made. Look at this plastic. It's a meat tenderizer, but I guess, I mean, pushing on it, it does make the holes, but I just, like I said, it doesn't go back up without help. Um, so I, I just, I don't know. I wasn't happy with this. I didn't pay a lot for it, but I thought it would be better made and I paid. Two sixty nine. I got three separate, um, two separate price adjustments. Plus, I ended up getting whatever that difference was for the refund. But I did get that, and I, like I said, I don't really recommend it. But I bought it, so I thought I'd show it. I got this for my Stanley dupe, and I'm really excited to use it, especially in the summer. These Stanley dupes, they're amazing. They keep your drink cold for hours. Sometimes I have ice the next day in my cup. 
But I got this, and they have different ones, different colors. I paid $3.14. I got two separate price adjustments, but it's really, really soft. Love this material. There's that, so you can fit your handle in there, and you can secure it. There's the bottom. But, yeah, it's really, really nice, smooth, and foamy. But I thought, that should just keep it even more cold. But I like the looks because I do have a couple of them that are plain. So now if I want to give it some pop of color and design, well, I've got that. I do like that and I'm excited to use it. Three four, excuse me, 314. Here I opened up all this. This was a watch organizer case because I've really accumulated the watch bands because they're so well made but cheap on Timu, the prices, and Sheen. So I just kind of have them down in a drawer. Um together and I'm probably gonna need one more of these two, two more of these but one, two, three, four, five. they hold eight and then you also have this little zipper here you can put it always looks like it's half unzipped you never know which way um you can put a charger or a block or something like that in there whatever you you want to do but yeah they just stick down in there like this and then right here so they won't flop around. So I thought that was nice. And they do have different colors. And yes, I will be doing some kind of iron on because I just can't have it plain. Oh, that is coming off my wrist. That was nothing on here. It is, <laughs> it's the makeup. So got that. I like it. $2.98. Oh, I'm just, my time. Ugh. Try not to worry about it because if it shuts off, that's just the way it's going to end. But that's why I wanted to go ahead and thank you for jumping on here and watching this with me and giving me some of your time, spending time with me. And I hope you find something on here that you like. <clears throat> this right here is a phone case. I paid $1.79. I'm also, because the prices are so cheap for the item that is well made, but I love the phone cases. Phone cases, watch bands, jewelry, makeup. I just, Timu and Sheen have made it worse. It does come with this little protector, but it's nice and bendy. I love the feel of it, but they have it in different colors, I think, but I like the gray and white leopard print. I thought it was really pretty. So, and this will fit. I have a 13 Pro Max. I think that's what it's called. I don't know. But, um... And here's some more jewelry. I mean, not jewelry. Do I want to take the time or just cut it? Oh, it opened easy. Okay, I did get some makeup in this one, too. This is called She Loves. I'm not good on brand name stuff, guys. So if there's something on here that you see that I have that is a dupe for a, another brand, maybe let me know. I might know some, some, but I honestly don't. I don't really know my makeup dupes. I don't even know a lot of purse dupes. Some, but no. Let's see what this is real fast. Oh, it's plastic. Liquid lipstick. I'm afraid if I run back there and get my makeup wipes out of my, off my vanity, I'll come back and then this will be shut off. And I don't want to say goodbye by turning my back to you guys and running back to get something. So, it's called She Loves. Okay. Number three is what I got. Diamonds Shine Liquid Lipstick. Well, it's kind of nice, fancy, schmancy packaging in there. If I can ever get it open. I'm even shaking. I'm trying to be in such a hurry. Oh, I need my hot mess hat. Does I literally feel like a hot mess. <clears throat> Excuse me. Let's just see. Uh, well, I need more of my wrist here, don't I? Ooh, I like this color. Oh, you guys, I really, really, really hope that doesn't jump off, but I do have some lip stuff and makeup. I'm going to run, go get my makeup wipes. I'm so sorry. It's so rude. I know it is. Oh, I should have grabbed it back my jewelry it was sitting right there because I was lazy this morning and didn't put it in my drawer these are my favorite I love this brand I buy them at TJ Maxx but those are my makeup wipes that I use 
but I never just wipe off my makeup and just be done. I'm Emmy's the same way. She says she always washes her face too, even after she gets her makeup off. Let's just make sure you get it all off. But I love that. I think the packaging is very pretty. Simple. It's really simple. So yeah, I like that. Thank you so much for letting me go back and get that. I hope I don't get a, nasty, a lot of nasty comments. Love that stuff. I really, really do. And I'm not liking having to look for prices today. Not at all. Not at all. Um, it's so funny. I don't even see shoe gloves. Watch them. I'll look up here in a second. There it is. 314, and it comes in eight colors. And if I knew this thing wasn't going to shut off, I will do my best to put the links on. Timu, sometimes when you try to copy and paste the order link that you did, it wants to um, just take you to their link, their page thing. So, And it's too con time consuming to do them one by one. So if there is something you like, just make a comment and um, I'll put it on there for you. And there might be some I've missed. I really need to go down after this and go through my comments. I've been hearting a bunch of, reading them and hearting a bunch of them. I haven't made a lot of comments because I'm so behind, but I'm hearting them to let you guys know that I read them. So it's a heart back. Thank you so much for your comments. I love them. This is an iron-on patch for $1.28. I just thought it was cute. I almost thought about putting it on a pair of jeans, like a pocket or by one of the holes on my jeans. I don't know. It says a little bougie, but I thought that was cute. It's embroidered. It's cute, but that's just a little iron-on patch. I have like nine, ten bags from the Dollar Tree. I have a Hobby Lobby haul. I have a TJ Maxx haul. That's like three trips to the Dollar Tree, though. It's not just one. And then I got these little bracelets. It's funny. I've been watching hauls, and I'm thinking, oh, my gosh. They just put this stuff on everybody's feet at the same time because it's like I wasn't seeing them, and now I... I am. I'm seeing other people haul them. This MacBook takes two fingers to slide up, but sometimes I don't know if my hand, I, my hands are really cold. I don't know if that's making me have a problem because it was just fine downstairs. This is a self-love, self-acceptance crystal bracelet, and I paid $1.66, and I did get two price adjustments. But I thought they were pretty. But what I was saying, though, I've started noticing people are putting these in their hauls, too. And I like it. It's pretty. I love the colors. Here's all the colors. See? Very pretty. But I've noticed a lot of people are having these bracelets. Um, I think it's in an order coming or I'm, it's in my cart. It's a grease can. I, I saved my bacon grease. And it's got a cute little pig on it. And I think it says grease, grease or something. And I've been seeing other people haul. And I'm like, Timu, you be throwing this stuff on all of our guys', you know, feeds or pages or whatever you want to call it. But yeah, I've been noticing people hauling it too. And once I saw these cute bracelets, you know, once you search something or you find something and click on it, they burn your feet up with hundreds of different ones. Um, come on, cold fingers. Let's get through this. I don't have time for this. I'm going to end up probably just not worrying about telling you guys the prices so we, I know we can get done. I think, I'm not sure. I've got a few different ones. I don't know if this is that one. It kind of looks like it. It's a heart initial a to Z charm. You can pick your initial on there that you want. I paid $1.17. But this one shows it has a little card with it that's supposed to say something. Like, life is tough. This little thing here. This one doesn't, so maybe it's something else in the bag and I've just got... But the stones look just like it. I picked an E because I got this for Emmy. I don't know if she'll wear it or not, but it was really pretty, and it looked like colors that she would do, so I don't know. I really like that. Life is tough, but so are you, and I would read this, but you know, here, 
I'll do this, and if you guys can see it, go ahead and maybe screenshot it, and then you can read and see what it says, but it's actually very pretty. The saying is, so I got that. I lost one of these earrings. They were inexpensive, but I bought the necklace to match. It's one of the first things I got on Timu. But I lost it on the couch or something. It fell off when I woke up one morning. It just was not in my ear no more. I really think my hands, my hands are so stinking cold. It's cold up here. I was down there watching um, Crafty Girl, I think, on her Dollar Tree hauls. And I was watching my couponing girl that I love to watch. I love her vlogs, too. She doesn't just do Timu and Dollar Tree. She does vlogs and talks about life. And she's very interesting. She's... She's had a, a lot of ups and downs in life, you know, like a lot of us have. And she's very courageous for getting on there and talking, you know, about things. And you you sympathize with her. Some things you understand because you've been through it. And some things you don't. Your heart goes out to her. But she's fun to watch. I mean, she's... I love the seriousness side. And I love the other side. She has her family in there sometimes. Why can I find these little things? Maybe I'm not going to worry about it. It's just one of these little tiny things. Okay. I paid a 71 cents, but they were cute. I don't know if you guys can see them because my camera don't want to adjust. Seven, oh, these aren't the ones anyway that I lost. This is a different pair I've never had. It's just a heart and it's just got a faux diamond in there, but I thought it was pretty for 71 cents. I got something black on my nail. But I got those. Very pretty. Would it just be better if I had, like, something black in front of things to make them stand out better? My phone wouldn't go on my ring light because of my, yeah, that little thingy. So I had to take it off and just put my phone up there, but maybe I can use it as my background for some stuff. So earrings. I think I'll put those over there so I'll misplace them. Okay, so there's that. Oh my goodness. See, I'm creeping up 27 minutes. I'm getting really nervous as I'm getting closer to the halfway mark of my shutoff. These I did have. I don't know where I lost them, but they're one of my favorite pairs of earrings, and I've gotten comp <laughs> if you guys didn't hear that, I would be very surprised. I don't know where that come from, but so excuse me. Oh, my word. It's like belch dried on here like it wasn't nothing. It wasn't a manly belch, thank goodness. But still, hello. How rude. Did not mean to do that, you guys. Totally. Oh, my gosh. I don't know. I'm just going to show you guys. I'm going through it one more time, but I am not wasting my time on here today. And it's um, it's frustration, but not on you guys. Um, They're just the simple zircone heart-shaped stud earrings. I love stud earrings. That's mainly what I wear. If I get too big of stuff, it's too heavy for the one that I have a tear in. It's 98 cents. And I did get a price adjustment, and I love them. And... They're just the perfect little size. They fit perfect there. But I do love these. And I like to have like a little diamond in the back. And I put the little heart there. It's really cute. Really cute. Just saying. Okay. Nothing exciting has been going on too much this week. Um, yeah, just that. Oh, now my screen went huge. Just the same old stuff at work. I've got a lot of lip stuff. And my screen being this way, I don't know if I want to take the time just to sit here. And I don't know why it's getting huge. The screen is being really stupid. Sorry. Shouldn't say that word. But it's being very annoying. It just like zoomed to where it was nothing but a white screen. Um, I got this. I'm going down this one more time. I don't find it. We're moving on and I'll just put the price if I can. And if it's something you like and I can't put the prices on there, you don't see the link. Just get with me and I'll, I'll get it for you. It's $1.48. It's supposedly 24 
Carrot Gold Foil Lip Gel Sparkling Glitter Lip Gloss, blah, blah, blah. You know, they always have that mile-long description of one simple little thing. And it's just clear, but it's sparkly, if you can see it in there. It's got like a soft pink to it. it smells good. It smells like bubble gum. Goes on nice. Well, keep it on my lips. Yeah, it's it's real pretty. It's see if you can see the shimmer, but that's what it looks like. Actually, let me excuse me, put this lid on. And I don't this light right here, it's not gonna cooperate. It's just the ring light, but it says gold 24 karat gold, but it's very pretty. Sorry about that. Here's some more. All these, I think, I bought three, two or three. They're either a dollar. Okay, these are the dollar thirty-eight ones, and I bought two. I think I seen this on Simply Jessica Marie. I'm not real sure, but she had bought a few glosses once. Um, I got a number one and a number seven, and since I've opened it, I don't know what number this is. Oh. Okay, it does have it in there, number seven. Here's the color. It's really a pretty color. Try to swatch it a little bit. Ooh, that come out thick. It just smells like makeup. That doesn't have a particular smell. It doesn't stink, but it just does just a makeup smell. Don't know. Oh, wrong. F Didn't mean to use that finger. It's it's okay. Maybe once you rub it in but yeah by itself it's it's not a bad color oh my word i'm starting to feel a little sticky um we did get harley we took her monday I, uh, my hubby dropped her off at the groomer so she's all cleaned up looks better you can tell she feels better by the way she's acting i picked her up after work um 89 cents for this one. I just thought it was cute because it had a little turtle on here. It looks summery. I hadn't opened that, so that's exciting. I mean, I got it out of the bag, but I never opened it, evidently, on my last haul. But isn't that a pretty colors? I love that. And then the cute little turtle on there. Can you guys see it okay? Here, let's get my face out of there. There we go. I think it's cute. I like that. Last Thursday, went to, our daughter is going to, she's a junior, but she's junior, senior. She's busting her booty. I hadn't opened this either. I just got it out of the bag, but evidently hadn't opened it. Really pretty box. I'm sure it's another makeup. Ooh, guys. Look at that. Love that packaging. That's fancy schmancy stuff going on right there. Lip balm, hydrating and soothing, keep all day moisture for lips. And then just the description goes on and on. But um, she's 17, she'll be 18 August, but she's a junior senior and she's doubling down on everything because she wants to graduate as a junior. And we went to a Veda cosmetology school and went with her Thursday to look at it and talk with them and have a tour of the place. And it's absolutely beautiful. Smells good. It's white. What is this going to do? It's just a lip balm, so I guess nothing. Glides on really, really smooth. It smells nice. It's got a real... It's like a strawberry smell, but it's very soft. Very subtle. I really like that. And like I said, if you guys know any of these things are dupes for any certain brand, let me know. I mean, I'm just... I'm curious. But, um... Yeah, so it's getting really exciting. It's, it's a big year. I'm not good at doing parties without putting... It just puts a lot of pressure on me, and I just get really overwhelmed and anxious. David turns 60 in September. Emmy turns 18 in August, and she graduates in June. Boom, boom, boom. It's like, oh my gosh, I can't handle all this. I need a party planner. Um, I think it's fun, 
and I would have so much more fun doing it if I wouldn't get so overwhelmed and anxious on just wanting everything to be perfect and, you know, there's got to be other people out there like that. Some people are just cool about it, cool as a cucumber and can plan and it just turn out great, but I stress a lot over those kinds of things. That's after it's all done and over with, I'm like, yes, usually it's a success, it's good. But um, anyway, I got another moissanite, and I don't know what it is, so I'm just going to go ahead and open it. Here I am scrolling like I'm going to find the picture when I don't even know what it is until I open the box. comes with this little cleaner. Does it have a little card? But it does have the GRA thing, and it talks about the stuff inside this box. So, oh, this is beautiful, and I hadn't opened Excuse me, I had gotten it out of the package, but I hadn't opened it. This is Gorge, guys. Look at that. Yes, that's what I'm talking about. I love that. It's got faux diamonds here. Yes. And then it's solid and has more faux diamond around it. It's a beautiful, beautiful ring. I got it in a seven. My hand's cold, and I don't know. Rings seem to fit bigger when my hands are cold. Okay. Seven. No, not there. Too big for my middle finger. So let's get these two off. Okay. Doesn't fit there, but usually it'll, it usually goes on one of these, but for some reason. Oh, okay. I fibbed. Look, that's so pretty. Love, love, love. Yes. I like that. Okay, so there is that. I don't even want to take the time to get my trash out of my way. I'm just going to throw it back there. It's going to be a hot mess when I'm done, but that's okay. All right, pushing my luck on trying to find the prices. Um, is this, nope, that's not it. If you hear anything, guys, sorry. It's, it's our ice maker downstairs. A little thing, it's quite noisy actually. Um, this one okay, it's a one carat moissanite, it's a promise ring, but I don't care. I thought it was pretty, it's very pretty. Um, I paid $12.14. No, I didn't. I looked the wrong thing. It was $10.39 for that. I wish I had the little tester because I really don't know if these are real or not, but they're absolutely gorgeous. I probably wouldn't recommend wearing them all the time, like taking them off before you go to bed. I don't think they'll turn your finger green, but um, unless you have jewelry cleaner, it's this little thing is not open. I'm gonna cut it. I would just go ahead and take it off so they don't get dull. Oh, <laughs> I love this color. Oh, oh I don't want to find prices today, guys. I'm getting so anxious because. It's like 12 minutes away from where it bombed me last time. $2.69. Yabolian Mermaid Shiny Lipstick. Comes in 12 colors. It's, it's metallic, blah, 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 blah. But look at this packaging first. This, I like having the light, but I'm telling you what, to show things sometimes is a pain in the butt. Very pretty. This is the color right there, and it's shimmery. So let's see. What is this? Oh, oh, I can see it. I don't know if you guys can or not. I think you can. Very subtle, very nice. I wish I didn't have anything on my lips because this is a color I would pick. I love this color. Happy with that. And it was $2.69. I did get a price adjustment. Oh, so many littles. Let me get my little box done while I'm thinking about it. I bought this with one use in my head, one purpose. And now I don't know if I'm going to use it for that. I might use it for something else. I got, it's a toilet tank storage box. I paid $10.49. It is now $14.98. 
but I, I got the white wash and I love it. It's got the jute rope at the end, which is really cute, knotted inside. But here it is, and I thought it was really pretty. I love it. But yeah, I was gonna put my toilet paper and then maybe like a poopery or whatever they call those, like, a, or a spray for your bathroom in there. But I'm also in the process of wanting to do a coffee bar and I don't have it done. I don't have a lot of things bought for it yet. So I don't know, I'm gonna try this. Um, let me find the size. This is actually 3.9 inches this way, 13.9 here, and then 6.7 here. So that's your dimensions for this cute little box. Love it. I would suggest putting it in your cart and maybe it will go down in price because that's what they normally do, up, down, up, down, up, down. And at the end, if I actually get through this haul without it shutting down on me, I'll show you some of the things that I had before, but I wanna at least get the haul part done, show my Timu items. Stuff has just been sitting up here for a while now and I wanna get it done. So I can put it away and get this area cleaned up. This is my crafting area and it's a hot, hot mess. Looks like stores just literally exploded up here. Okay, comes in a cute little fuzzy little soft box, velvet box. This is another, G yep, just another card inside. Ooh, this one's pretty. I got another ring. I was really on the moissanite kick. This is pretty. This is a half a carat also. And if you're going to be a bear, why not be a grizzly, right? Well, in some of these, I played it safe just because my cart was adding up fast for one. And I was just starting to buy too many of the jewelry stuff. But come in this little bag in the box. This is what it looks like. I bought it in an eight. I love the design. It's very pretty, shiny. But I love this cut. I don't know if you can kind of, oh my gosh, it's so hard. I don't know if you can see how it's over here, comes off to the side, then over here it starts on the opposite opposite side, the band does. But yeah, very pretty. Um, it fits, it fits fine on there, but I would think, yeah, it's more for like my middle finger. I'll be having rings all the way around on every finger, all the way down. Okay, so there's that, and I paid the 10.39. Um, here is some more cute earrings. Let's see if I can find these. I remember seeing these as many times as I flipped through this thing. Come on, cold fingers. Cooperate. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Are they in here? I don't even see these in here. Oh, please say this is in another order. I'm not going to find other stuff. Oh, I don't like it. They used to be so good at just putting one order together, and now here they are. Whew. 89 cents, and I got four price adjustments, so I have no idea what these things ended up costing me. A little bit of nothing. But look, little faux diamond bows, these little black hearts. Once again, really, really cute and dainty. I like the tiny, tiny earrings. Those are cute, 89 cents. Okay, and I have more makeup. I had not opened this one yet. This is called Probiotic Skin Care. Well, I don't even have a clue, because I just cut that open. So even though I got it out of my bag on my first fail of a haul, I never got to open it. Move screen, please. Oh my word. I don't know, guys. There it's jumping huge again. I don't know what I'm doing when I make it like that. All I'm doing is my two fingers trying to swipe and this thing has went wonky. Huh. Ugh. I am feeling stressed in this video, if you can but tell. But I can't stress enough when you put your time in this and you're trying to make your films right and then you just, it does what it did. I'm like five minutes away from the cutoff point from the first time that I, only time I tried. 
But I'm going to show you this real fast. I don't know if it'll give it to me or not. And I wish this was touch screen, but one, two, three. The fit, second one from the bottom on the left side over there, my, it's my left on here. It says price adjustment. Literally, come on you. If you click price adjustment, 42 cents. I haven't even showed these yet. But if you click on request a price adjustment, you can receive it in seconds. And I'm telling you, within seconds, you'll start getting notifications and texts that um, you've already received your credit. So if you're new to Timu, which I'm sure there's not too many more people out there that are new to it, that is how you do a price adjustment. And it is quick. It is very fast. I'm getting texts through my phone now saying that I got 45 even though it said 42 i don't know if it's tax or whatever they give you back to but it always seems like the price is a couple pennies off but i don't know what this is right now what is that and i have to open it i don't even have my cloud cutter oh yes i do it's still there from when i tried to do this the first time these if you get these from timu are very very sharp so be careful but they're cute i got a three pack for Maybe a dollar or somewhere around there is a really good deal. Um, I'm going to scroll one more time. I'm going to look up, and I'm sure I'm going to be talking to myself because y'all's going to be gone. Stop. Scroll. Oh, my gosh. Scroll. That is not that, is it? I don't know. I'm just going to open it. I'm sick of scrolling and not finding what I'm looking for and wasting our time. Okay. It looks like this. It's, it says Rose Hip Eye Cream Stick for Fine Lines Dark Circles. It's $1.68 and I got two price adjustments. Doesn't smell. It's just a soft pink color. But yeah, I guess you just put that around your eyes, your fine lines around your eyes. Rose Hip Eye Balm. Is something puffy and hydrating and something else. And I, it's so tiny, you guys. I cannot even read it. But it just twists up. So we'll see how that works. But yeah, there's that. Just put this stuff away. And I'm not even going to worry about trying to open up bags because it takes too long. Oh my gosh, 50 minutes coming up, you guys. It was like 50 minutes and two seconds, and I'm at 47.23. Are you guys still going to be with me after 50, 50 minutes? Oh, a couple minutes, we'll find out. Go, 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 scroll. Okay, 79 cents. This is the thing I said that I, one of my first buys that I did from Team Moon. I had a matching necklace. It's cute. Um, there's no faux diamonds. It's just silver and it's a puppy paw. But yeah, I got those. I don't think this helps. Nothing helps. My camera's terrible for adjusting. I think you can see a little there. But those are cute. And yeah, I got them for 79 cents. No price adjustments. But with that price, who's complaining? Not me. And this is an eye corrector. I think for like eyeliner and stuff like that when you put it on. Not that way. Not that way. It is right here for two eighty seven. I got a price adjustment. Yeah, it's an eyeliner correct corrector for eyelashes, eyebrows, whatever. But it comes in this little box. Once again, if anything's a dupe, I'm just curious. Um, let me know. I don't even care if I tear the boxes up because they're just gonna go in my makeup thing on my vanity. This is it. What is this? What? Okay. Well, it's got three pieces here. One is shaped like that. And then the other one's like this, which I'm assuming this is the way. I have no idea. It's like the storage part, but I do not know. Oh, oh. Okay, there's comes with three extra. Well, that's actually kind of nice for two eighty seven. So uh, as you can tell, I didn't do anything with myself when I got home. I still need to jump in the shower. I just wasn't feeling as soon as I got home. But I don't know. 
it kind of hurts to rub that. It's not very smooth. I mean, it's spongy, but for some reason it kind of hurt my eyes. I don't know. Could just be me. It's got a a wetness to it, so there is wetness. So if you have your makeup on, it's going to take that off. You'll have to dab it back on with your applicator. But that there's that. And you have four, three extras. They're dry, so I don't know if it gets in there, how it gets wet. Yeah, these are dry, but I don't know. That's cool. I'll give it a try, right? If it does, it's not good. I mean, I'm not out a lot of money, but um, yeah, got that. Look at all the, I said I bought makeup. Okay, this is $1.34 or $1.38. And here's another one that I got. I'm upstairs, Emmy, doing a haul. <laughs> um, let's see. Oh my gosh, we've already made it past my cutoff point. It's 50 minutes and 50 seconds in. Oh, I don't. And I'm fumbling too much. I can't. I can't open it because I'm just. Okay, I feel like I'm pushing my lip now because we made it past that mark. Oh my. Gosh, Ooh, I don't have patience. I don't have patience today. So there's that color. Um, there's that. I don't. Both of those kind of seem the same, and I don't really. It smells the same. It's it's not a stinky smell. It just kind of smells like a soft perfumey smell, or just regular makeup. I don't know. But you just squeeze it out of there. That's the color. I'm going to have to try these on to see if I like them, but just on my wrist, I'm not real crazy about the orangey, orangey-ish, caramel-ish color, but we'll see. So, there's that one. I don't know what this is either. Oh my gosh, why is everything in these little... Let's find out. Um, mm, cute. Don't know what you are. I literally don't remember what I ordered. I just want to get this paper plastic off. This is the box. July Star Smooth Gloss. I have no idea what the price was. Okay, I'm not doing it. I'm tearing the box. Doesn't want to slide out there. I think these were the, and these are $1.34 or $1.38. I do like that color. I think that's beautiful. So let's swatch it and see. Once again, it's just a little squeezy one. Ooh, I like that color. Yes, yes. There it is. I do like that color. I like that color. About time for a new one. It's getting to a mess. All right, but yeah, getting pretty excited. I'm way off of what I was earlier, but for Veda school is like really, really cool. It's $25,000 a year to go there. She's looking into grants and things like that. So that'll definitely help, but that's exciting. Um, let's see. This right here I think is the plumping comes in 10 colors. I got the clear shimmery and it was $1.34. I got like two or three of these. I got number seven, number 10, number one, and this is number 10. And I can't, it's those little tiny things you gotta, get this. There we go. Okay, then it slid off. But it's just clear. Nothing fancy on that one. It's just a clear one. I feel like I'm not doing you guys right if I don't swatch stuff. Um, it's real pretty though. It does have a shimmer to it, if you can see it. Real pretty shimmer. So that'd be pretty over top of something else. I feel like my wrist is getting stained. Maybe I need to start swatching over here. There's that. And got this. Oh, this was um 
This is called, well, there's stickers on the box. Wow. This says designed in USA. Hmm. Well, you know, but that's the name, Foera. I, I don't know if that's the dupe for anything either, but it's this stuff up here. Please see, I'm going the right way. Yes. Long lasting hydrating makeup primer, 348. But it has a little lid. There's your little bottle. Just a cute little bottle. It's not a huge, it is six milliliters or 0.20 fluid ounces. So it's it's small. Here's my hand. So that's kind of small. But I thought I'd try it. I don't really here. We'll do this. Got a little bit. Every little bit counts when it's in that small of a container. It's smooth, glides on, easy, and doesn't really have a smell to it. I don't even know if you can really see where I rubbed it in there, but I did. So there's that. We'll give it a go. Oh my gosh, it put plastic in everything. I mean, I, it's good, but it's frustrating me right now because I don't have the patience for it because, well, y'all already know now. It's my phone. Um, July Star. So I got a different color, I'm sure. This is number one. This is a pretty color. Sorry I come in so, so fast, you guys. But that's a really pretty color. This is, I don't know why I want to do everything in my middle finger. But yeah, it's really, it's really soft. It rubs in really soft, really light. Might be another good top coat for something else. I don't know. Might look completely different on your, on your lips. Um, those are $1.34, $1.38. Oh, they got me these. They're just little cute, little metal stud hearts. I hope you can see that okay. But yeah, they're like the diamond or stainless steel maybe. It's not really the gun metal. Um, I think these are down here. Fingers are wet from my makeup wipe. Um, not down there. Okay. 98 cents and I did get one price adjustment. Could have been for a penny. But these are teeny tiny. Yeah, but I like little studs. I do. I really, really do. This was another necklace I had showed, and I really liked it, too. It's out of the bag and everything now. But, are you guys still with me? Yes. Oh. Eh. I'm going to watch this haul replay, and I'm not going to like it. I don't even have a thumbnail. Don't even know if I'm going to get a thumbnail. This is a real pretty necklace. And it's a three chain link for the necklace. But it's really, really pretty. And I paid a little bit of nothing. Surprise, surprise. For this as well. Is that a... No. Um, I am so pushing my luck getting these prizes. I shouldn't even mess with it. I don't know. I don't see it. And this is going to be my third time and I'm done going, scrolling through here. I won't scroll again since I can't find it. There it is, $2.69. I did not get a price adjustment, but it's gorge, gorgeous, gorgeous. I love that. Love it. So there's that. Oh my gosh, I got two more makeups. I really hope there's no more makeup in the bag. I don't want to open up any more makeup. The others wouldn't open, and that one couldn't wait to get out of the package. It just jumped right out of the plastic. This right here is $1.97. It's called Wizard of Oz Starry Active Color Changing Lipstick. Price adjustment for, like I said, $1.97. Real pretty box. It's called... Oh, I had it right. It's so hard because... I don't flip this around or it doesn't get flipped around until I'm getting ready to upload so everything's backwards when I look. 
packaging is gorge. I'm loving that. So pretty. So pretty. And there is this. It smells kind of chemically, to be honest. Real pretty. It's almost like a mermaid color, but they call it the Wizard of Oz. It's pretty. Of course, it's going to be that. Everything seems to go pink. I don't know what it'll be on my lips, and I've got stuff on. So, but that packaging is, and just by itself, is worth buying because it's so pretty and it just snaps shut. Tell me that is not a pretty sparkly package. I love that. Okay. Enough Googling over that. This was $1.38 or $1.34. I don't remember, but I think it's my last one. It's another July star. And this is the number two. Tight fit. Why was I going towards all these pink colors? Probably because it looked more burgundy on there. I don't know. But that is a pretty color. I hope it's a little darker and not so bright. Hmm. It's not. But we'll see. You never know the final result until you put it on. It's actually soft when you do that. They all kind of blend in really soft and not so dark. But always stiffen on your lips too. So... Okay, you guys, we're in an hour. I think we're close to being done. I think this is oh, something else. It's another moissanite. Um, this is at the bottom. I've seen it a million times. One carat moissanite key pendant necklace, 925 sterling. I paid $13.59. What is it now? Just out of curiosity. Oh, I don't want discontinued. That well, they have other ones like it that are $14.39, $13.19, $17.09, all kinds of different prices. So just because the person I bought it from, it is still available. But I thought that was a beautiful, stop, beautiful necklace. Little key. Is it even the right way? Yeah, so there's the... Stop. It's only because I'm having the moments that I am trying to do this video. If it wasn't for that, it'd be fine. Here, I'm going to hold that. There. Very pretty. Very dainty. All the chains are dainty, but they're all so nice and sparkly. Love that. It just came in the box. I don't, it didn't show a card. It's got a little cleaner with it. But, yeah, there's no whatever card thing that was certification thing this right here I thought would be nice when you go on vacation um, you can separate your jewelry and I did get a price adjustment refund it's $2.59 different colors it unzips good I do like this you can hang your three necklaces wherever you choose put it down there so it's not getting all tangled up your rings your earrings or whatever you want to use this for but I got the soft pink it kind of looks peachy on here but it's actually real soft pink but they did have other colors I paid $2.51 but I thought that was nice and compact for trips so there's that I thought this was cool I got it for my refrigerator it's down 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 um to put pictures six pieces and it's a magnetic picture frame this is a four by six and there is different sizes and i got it for 434 um just gonna cut it my nails don't want to cooperate they never do anyway i mean they're the gel you know nails so they're thicker so you can't ever open up anything your regular normal nails are thinner and you can pick up stuff better if I drop a bobby pin or something small or a coin on the floor, you might as well hang it up. I'm just sitting there forever trying to do it, and I can't pick it up. But yeah, these are cool. They're magnetic. You put your little 4 by 6 picture in here, and you put it on your refrigerator, your file cabinet, somewhere in your office if you have a metal desk, anywhere. But you get six of those, and I thought that was a cool, 
cool thing. So yeah, and I can put pictures up there. I have to put tape on the back of the pictures to make them stand on there. I have a nice little magnetic frame. So I love that. $4.34 for six. And I did get a few clothing things. Okay. I never got this one out, but I did the other two, I think. So, this is cute. I wish it was a little longer. I got this in an extra large 14. I paid $5.78. <coughs> so you guys still in there? Yeah. And, <coughs> excuse me, this plus size casual sweatshirt, but it says, I don't have an attitude. I have a personality you can't handle. And you guys have probably seen that before. And they have different colors, gray, white, maybe. I like the black. So I like pink and black together. So I thought it really popped. It's more like the t-shirt material, but this is soft. It's not rough on your skin. If you can see that. There we go. It's focusing. But yeah, it's really, really soft. And I don't have to look. It's 100% polyester. But it's nice. I like it. It's real smooth. Yeah, this is pretty. Here. Booyah. Why is my face so red? It's my anxiety. It's my nerve. Oh my gosh. You should see the... Well, you can see it, but you should feel the heat coming from my face. Oh my gosh, it almost feels like a hot flash. I'm just... I'm stressed out. I'm stressed out, y'all. <sighs> Okay, this says Mama 668. I got a I got a refund for this one. I did open this one. It was an extra large. This fits like a small or a medium. I have extra large stuff. And to me it's just not that big. But anywho, oh no, this isn't it. This isn't the one. This isn't the one I got a refund for. This is just a plain green one and I love it. I'm going to just gonna do an iron on. It's just something for me to make a shirt. Um, five seventy eight. Yeah, and I just got a price adjustment, but it's really thick and soft. I love this. Actually, price adjustment and refund. Okay, I got a refund. Maybe this is the one that. Something else was an extra large, and it's a lot bigger. And this just says an extra large, and it's more like a smaller medium. I mean, this is really at my waist. It doesn't hang down low at all or anything. The arms, I don't know if you can see. Oh, probably not, because nothing wants to cooperate. And I'm tripping over all my Dollar Tree bags. I mean, I guess the arms aren't too bad, but they're usually longer with an extra large. I love oversized, but this is, no joke, really thick. I love the color. I wish it was bigger, like really fit like a true extra large. I mean, it may look kind of big on there, but it's it's not. This is an extra large that I have on, and it's, way, it's past my butt. This right here is like not quite at the middle of my butt cheeks, so... I just didn't think it sized accurately. Okay, almost done. Yes. Okay, then I got this. Be real, not perfect. This is an extra large, and this is what I'm talking about. This is bigger. Once again, it's the same fabric inside, and it's really soft. Love that. And yes, this one is way past my butt and it's an extra large. I mean, it's, see, it's so much, I have to go back here. The other one just fits smaller, but I really love that pink. It's really soft. I don't mind this feel though. It's not a yucky plastic feel. Um, yeah, it's nice. Might do me thumbnails later. I don't know. I didn't really have anything that stood out to me. This is another one I liked, and I got a um, price adjustment, six sixty eight. I love this. Love that green. It says Mama. This is long. Excuse me, it's past my booty. Let's see, extra large. Look how big that's going on my hands. I don't know why I like it that oversized, but I truly do, and it's comfortable. 
And here's your inside. A little different, but you know, pattern's about the same, if it'll adjust. Very soft. I love that. Yeah, this is a very soft shirt. Really like that. Really, really do. Got me some jeans. Already tried these on. Just because I'd already opened them and I like them. That mama was $6.68. I got a price adjustment. And then the jeans down here. I really like these. And they're not really long. Because I'm 4'11". I used to say 4'11 and a half. But I'm sure at 46 I'm probably in 4'11 now. $15.98. And I got two price adjustments. And I love these jeans. Yes, I love all the holes. Love the ends. How they are. I think those are cute. It's not a real thick denim, but it's a nice thin denim. It's going to be great for summer. Not on the real, you know, just sort of like hot days, but yeah, I love them. Got distress there. I wish their pockets were bigger because I think small pockets on the butt kind of make your butt look weird. I don't know. That's just me. But yeah, stretchy. Um, there's a lot of lengths. When I put them on, I thought I loved how they fit and the length was good. And then I got to look in the mirror. There's a lot between where the zipper ends and the crotch. And it almost looks really weird. So if I wore like a long shirt or something over it, you wouldn't see that. But I kind of don't like this huge, huge gap right there. But the jeans are overall adorable. I love them. I got these in a extra large 12. But I'm, people say to go up a little bit bigger what you would normally wear on the jeans when I read a lot of the reviews. So make sure you read your reviews. So, oh, and they got a little distressing. I didn't pay attention. I was talking about the size, but distressing on the pocket too. Okay, we actually made it. So I might, for, thank you for watching. All my griping and grumbling was just anxiety, just waiting for this to mess up on me and kick y'all off again. And it didn't. <sighs> thank you, thank you, thank you. But um, if you're a crafter person, stay on here real quick because some people were asking other stuff that I've made with my Cricut Explorer Air 2, not just clothes. So I was going to show you some things I made at the house. Um, If you're not a crafter, truly thank you so much for watching. I hope you stayed on for this whole hour of a mess. Um, and I hope you come back. I hope you enjoyed it. So thank you so much. Um, real fast before I do this myself. I went to Hobby Lobby with my son's girlfriend in the very back corner. They had a clearance and they had all kinds of wood frames, picture things, wood signs, different shapes, shelves, everything on clearance. So I bought this one, regular $12.99 for $3.24. It was blank. And I did with my Cricut. I love the whitewash on it. But it says Wicker, established 2015. And it had this with it. I just pulled, you know, weeded it all out. But that's what I have in my kitchen. It's something I made for our kitchen. So if you're curious of other things you can do with your Cricut, that Cricut is not limited. You can do so much stuff with it. There's that. My bathroom has been playing for a week or so because I've had all these pictures down. I didn't want to, I was so bummed. I didn't want to go back and put them downstairs and bring them back up. I made this one. It was regular $6.99. I don't know. I probably paid a dollar or two dollars for it, but it was plain and it's kind of bumpy. This one didn't turn out real good, but when it's on the wall and the light's not shining, we never have a light shining just like that. It's just, you know, usually up on your wall like this. But it says, soak, heart, relax, heart, unwind. And I don't know. I thought that was cute. And like I said, these, this is my first time even doing those. This one right here, I don't remember how much it was, but it's a metal one. I might have paid my most for this one, which I think it was like 4 or $5. Totally worth it, though. But it was plain. I put this as bathroom, and... Um, we did all that out, and this is one big piece, and just put it on there. I bought it as good as I could. Um, I have a shelf above my toilet, <clears throat> and this goes above that, and I have some Hobby Lobby decor that I bought and I decorate with, but that's one of them, and I just love these wood frames. 
<clears throat> the last one I have, and it's more like a see-through. So let's do this. It's to look like a window. So I found something like more like a retro where it says fresh soap and water towels free five cents. So that's what it looks like, this little thing. It's just little wood. And I peeled all that out and weeded it out and put it on there. I balled it as good as I could. I know it's not dead center perfect, but there's that. And it did have a jute rope, but I didn't do it like that. I actually just hang it with this lip on a nail and it stays just fine for where it's at. It doesn't get bumped, but as you can see, it's clear and that's plastic, but I don't know. Besides shirts and things like that, that's what I've made with it for home stuff. Um, it's not the best, but it's my starter point. And you can do cards, stickers. Gosh, you can do so much stuff with a Cricut. It's amazing. But anyway, thank you again for watching. It's almost Friday. Today's Thursday. We just got one more week. A lot of us do. Some have to work weekends. If you do, I hope you have a great work weekend. I'm probably going to jump off here and have the same outfit on, but I'm going to try to get done with the Dollar Tree haul and see if it'll let me do a short one. So, because I might have to do three or four. All right, guys, have a blessed night. Thanks again so much for being patient with me and listening to me grumble. So, all right, next time, guys. See ya.